We have an update about a possible protest in the triangle over the murder of George Floyd at the hands of Minneapolis police. This comes hours after the officer who was seen on video kneeling on Floyd's neck was arrested and charged with third degree murder. Our Bridget Chapman joins us live in Raleigh with the latest. Bridget. Yeah, there were rumors of protests taking place downtown here tonight. So far, we have not seen any sign of, of a protest, but this did lead the county to close some of their buildings early, like the courthouse here. A county spokesperson says they closed four downtown buildings by 4 o'clock. A spokesperson said they were made aware of the potential for downtown dem demonstrations related to the recent events in Minneapolis. The Wake County Sheriff's Office says the closings were out of public safety concerns, and we have not seen any protests in the Raleigh area this week. Different organization leaders say there aren't any plans for tonight. There is one plan for tomorrow night, though. It's scheduled at 5 o'clock in front of the courthouse on Fayetteville Street. Organizers are calling it a National Day of Action Justice for George Floyd, Breonna Taylor, Ahmaud Arbery, and lives cut short by Raleigh and Durham Police Departments. Tonight at 11 o'clock, you'll hear from a local NAACP leader about his thoughts on these protests and his message for the community. Live in Raleigh, Bridget Chapman, CBS 17 News.